Okay, in this example, we want to look at real values, right? A real value. We want to compare two values, two nominal values, and we want to see which one is worth more. Okay, in order to see which one is worth more, we got to transfer these nominal values into real values. So, for example, Let's say we have the following situation. Let me just change the color of the pen. We have a following situation. We have the year, the price level, the nominal income. So let's say the year is 2005, the price level is 116, and the nominal income is $40,000. And 2008, price level is 132 and the nominal income is $56,000 so what we then do is we're asking the question is this person better off in the year 2005 earning $40,000 when the price level is 116 or are they better off in 2008 earning $56,000 when the price level is 132 which one is actually worth more Right? Well, what we can do, because these are two nominal uh, values, what we want to do is we want to turn them into real values. So we have to compare them to a base year. You could make one of these the base year, or you could do how we do it in the lecture. We could just make the base year, I don't know, the year 2000. So I said, if that's the base year, then the price level is 100. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to use this table, the information in this table, and we're going to do two things. One, all we're going to do is we're going to find the real income instead of the nominal income, the real income of the year 2005, right, in terms of the year 2000. Okay, so basically all we're going to do is we're going to compare 2005 with 2000. So we said that the real income in the year 2005 is going to be equal to the nominal income 2005 divided by the price level in 2005 multiplied by the price level of your base year 2000. The nominal income in the year 2005 is 40,000. The price level in 2005 is 116, and the price level of the base here is 100. All right, so what we do, we just go 40,000, divide 116 times 100, and you will get 344.83 times 100, 34,483 dollars. Okay, so what are we saying? Right. Oops, let me undo that. Undo that. I don't know what I just did. Okay, never mind. Right. All we are saying is that in terms of real value, your real income in 2005 is... $34,483. So can I move that? I'll just try and move this down. Right. So that, that's what we're saying is that the real income is $34,483. Okay. Now we do the same thing. where we want to find the real income in 2008 in terms of 2000 of the year 2000 so it's the same formula as we just did just now now we're going to find real income 2008 will be equal to the nominal income 2008 over the price level in 2008 
multiplied by the price level of the base here, 2,000. 56,000 over 132 times 100 will give us 424.24 times 100. 42,424. So what are we saying? What are we? Is we say the real income in two thousand and eight is forty two thousand four hundred and twenty four. Thus, this individual is better off in the year two thousand and eight because the real value of this individual's income is forty two thousand four hundred twenty four dollars, whereas in two thousand five, this individual's real income was thirty four thousand four hundred and. $83.